TV. Thank you so much for tuning in today. You guys see the title. It's a slightly different video. It's an exciting video. I am buzzing to make it. I'm going to get some food in a minute because I'm freaking starving. Just for this work. Drop the video a like if you're excited. Let's get started. Topped off with a zero calorie dosage of ketchup. Get in me. <clears throat> I feel like every single one of these Alpha Leap reviews that I do, I end up making a wrap of some kind at some point during a video. I don't know. Now I know in the last Alpha Leap review that I did, I said I was going to buy some 3D energy. Um, to be honest, completely forgotten about it. So, off the back of making this video, I promise I'll be buying a case and sorting it out and making a video and all that kind of stuff. Um, and you guys can hear my thoughts. Take a look at the sky, by the way. It's by, what, quarter past four now here in the UK, right? Take a look at the cool sky. Oh, uh, yep, sick filming, Liam. There we go. It's like pink and stuff. Cool. Gotta love nature and stuff, you know. Always come when I need you. You know I'll be there for you. Where are you now? Where are you now? Always try my best for you. You just know it is true. Where are we now? All right, morning, everybody. So something I've been doing recently is actually just having scrambled eggs. Well, I mean, I've been doing it for quite a while now, to be honest. Saving a few cars for later on in the day when I have like pasta and rice and stuff like that. Um, so that I could have a little bit more of that and having no carbs uh, uh, just for breakfast because I often have scrambled egg and so scrambled egg on toast or scrambled egg wrap or something like that kind of goes well, right? Today I am going to be adding that back in and just going to put the scrambled egg that I'm making in a wrap purely because I'm training shoulders. I'd like to hit some numbers today. I'm just in the mood to do so. I'm not normally, but I, I want to do well in today's session, you know? So one of these wraps is 34.2 grams of carbs. So a decent amount of carbs, you know, especially on top of what I would normally be having. So let's eat. <laughs> Top tip, if you do ever put egg in a wrap, don't put too much in there. Just get soggy and then you'll end up just with, just with a wet wrap, you, you know? <laughs> Top tips with Liam on today's video. <clears throat> Mom, do you know where that red suitcase is? Oh, smashing. I'm gonna use it and take it. To right, okay, packing will be next. Um, it's taking a back seat because I have, um, well, probably the best way to go about this. 
let me just show you. So all of this stuff is um, stuff from my childhood. This is the room that I kind of grew up in, if you like. Um, we call it the Tiger's Room now because I'm in my old sister's room. But we call it the Tiger's Room because it is decorated in Leicester Tigers logos and colours and everything. There's also Liverpool stuff in here as well. Um, but with Charlotte moving in a couple months ago, um, we don't have an awful lot of space in my well, our bedroom, right? And so we're having my sister's old bed, which has storage underneath that that needs to get put in. But these cupboards are currently full of well, crap. They're full of crap. So my job right now is to just sieve through the crap <laughs> to make it slightly less crap to make room for more crap that came when Charlotte moved in. Yeah. A gold Owen! A gold Owen! I knew it! Yes! Look at him! Probably mentioned it once or twice on the channel. If you've been watching me for a while, you will know that when I was younger, I used to support players rather than teams. You know how everyone has a favourite football club? They just like Liverpool. They just like Manchester United or Barcelona or whatever. I used to prefer individual players. And my two fa oh my god I dropped him! My two favourite players were Michael Owen and Steven Gerrard. Right here I have two mint condition old power pods of my two favourite players from when I was a kid. Michael Owen and Steven Gerrard. I'm so excited right now. <laughs> What number has he got? Number four, of course. Oh, yeah. With a gold oh. pod. Are you ready? I'm gonna change fingers, okay? Ready? Three, two, one. Oh, I lost it! So this is the kind of stuff that's in this room. This is the ball that I learned to actually spin on my finger. Um, I have a couple of things like a Rubik's Cube and spinning a ball on my finger and there's juggling as well are things that I actually learned to do when I was a kid because I used to get injured a lot as a kid before I started training and all that kind of stuff. So I had to keep myself amused by learning to solve the Rubik's Cube and learning to spin a ball on my finger and like juggle and <laughs> those are the three main things really but like <laughs> Matt just found this too. I think this is the wallet from when I last went to It contains some money for the next time that I go to <laughs> Different balls and everything. Oh yeah. Are you keeping count? Are you keeping... Oh, oh. Okay. I need a drink now. Ah. Hello, my love.
Where's this Alphalie packet? It's half past two, so I mean it could still turn up today. But it's normally kind of here by now, like this time last month when I filmed the video, I was filming my kind of unboxing and all the stuff, like now. I've not actually even had an email that said it's going to be dispatched, but in the email they said that there might be delays. Not to everybody, but to some people, so unfortunately I think I might be one of those people, but it is what it is, I guess. Whoa. I actually, actually need this. Hey! Oh my god, yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Right, okay, so. Let me just explain what happened with this, this package, right? Um, it was delivered a day later than normal. Um, I don't know why it just didn't get, whether it was something in the order that got, that got delivered that I, 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 don't, I don't know, right? Normally it gets delivered by the Tuesday. Today is now Wednesday um, and it's only just came and luckily my mum was actually in to take the order otherwise I would have missed it and ended up having to get it on Thursday, which would have been super freaking annoying. But either way, we have it. I ordered four items for myself, okay? I'm here in my alpha, I mean you can't see that, I'm in my alpha league joggers right now um, and I'll show you what is inside. Let's go. Okay, so we picked up four items in total. The Aspire tee in black, the premium cutoff in white, the rolled muscle tee in black, and the striped hoodie. All of these items are in a medium. I'm around about 41-ish, maybe a little bit more inch chest. I'm five foot six, five foot seven-ish, and weighing in at around about 175 pounds as of yesterday morning. So, first up we have the cutoff in white. The reason we are going for this first is because you guys have already seen this in the last review that I did in the October, it was October, right? In the October launch. And um, if you remember, it actually was a little bit big, or I say a little bit big, it was actually massive, right? Um, and that was because for some reason, I don't know, there must have just been some mix up with the packaging um, and it said medium on the packaging, but then the actual thing inside of the packaging was large. And so that was why it was so big on me. Like I'm, I'm, not, I'm not a large. But one thing with Alphalete is you cannot return anything once you have ripped the tag off. So do be careful, check everything. Um, because obviously it was then out of my control and it was no longer their responsibility. I ripped the tag off so I could take a cool Instagram photo, which turned out to be not even that good, right? And so I couldn't get my money back. But anyway, we have it again in a medium. So let's see what it looks like. I hope this one fits. <laughs> Okay, this is better. Yeah, see, this makes sense now. I mean, I I looked at it last time, right? And I was just like, this this doesn't fit how it's like it should. It's too long and everything. But anyway, this is better. So as you guys can see, this one actually fits a lot better. It fits as it it should. Like this was all the way down here on the last one, and it just it it it, it honestly. I mean, I thought it looked okay because originally I was only looking at myself in the kind of in in the camera viewfinder, but um, yeah, th this one fits a lot better, so that's good. Okay, so here is the Aspire T. The last time I had an athlete kind of performance type-ish t-shirt 
was the one that you guys saw earlier in the video, the one that says Alpha Lead from like, I don't know, must be a year, 18 months ago now. Um, and I haven't had one since then, purely because of like, money reasons and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, th this is this is nice. The thing I like about this is that it's like really stretchy for one. That's another thing, right? Hang on, Christian. Christian, I see you man, I see you watching these videos purely because in the last one about the joggers when I was talking about how the joggers could be stretched and then I was like, I have to have those. And this is what sold it to me. When Christian did this, right, he went and I was just like, I have to have those joggers. I see you in these promo photos stretching out that Aspire tee. I see you, I see you. Anyway, what I do actually like about this t-shirt is that it's kind of, well, it's, it's, it feels light. I mean, I've got to be honest, when... Christian was talking about it in in the video that he did. He said that it felt kind of heavy, and I was like, "Oh no, no, I kind of, I don't, I don't want that. That's just not really for me." Personally, I prefer lightweight stuff that's still gonna, you know, fit in all the right places and stuff. And that's kind of what this is. Plus, it has the pretty sick geoprint on the collar, which I, I think is kind of cool. I've never really seen anything quite like that um, before, so that's that's kind of cool too. Next up, we have the premium rolled muscle tee. Now this, um, the reason I bought this, right, is purely because I don't, I, I kind of wanted something that was, right, I'm going away with Charlotte this weekend, you guys will see that in due course in future videos and stuff, but I kind of wanted something that wasn't really fancy, but also wasn't like a gym t-shirt, because I basically wear gym clothes like this absolutely everywhere, right? And so I kind of wanted something that was in between, that if we were to go to a, a decent restaurant, let's say for lunch, uh, in said place that we are going away to, then I would feel okay walking into that restaurant in this, if that makes sense. Um, so that's my reason for buying this. Um, again, in a medium, um, feels nice. It feels kind of kind of similar to this, but a little bit thicker. Okay, so. Like I say, um, everything is in a medium, and uh, to be honest, from what I've seen so far, I would say that uh, everything I've bought would kind of serve its purpose. Like I say, I would happily walk into you know a restaurant. All this has is the little Alpha Elite logo on the back of the t-shirt, and so it's kind of plain, kind of nice. You know, you can wear this fairly comfortably, like I say, in a restaurant, but then at the same time, I don't know, I could just wear it out and about everywhere. The fourth and final item for today's launch. Now, um, I think I've said it for every single item so far. This is the one I'm most excited about. Purely because um, I already have my Stripe joggers and did a video kind of dedicated towards them um, a few videos back. So go and check that out if you have not already after you finish watching this one. I haven't had an Alpha Elite hoodie ever since the first green hoodie. That kind of emerald green one that they did when I was back in first year. So when I was first year fat, right, I was talking about this hoodie and this is the first one that I've bought that's an actual hoodie. I've had jackets and stuff, um, but this one is supposedly the best thing since sliced bread. So we'll feel how it is. Nice and soft on the inside. Ugh. Cool, right? Okay, it's tighter than I was expecting. Hang on, let me, let me, let me see. Let me see how I'm looking. Oh, I like it. I like it, man. I like it. I like it a lot. Just one thing to complete the outfit. Yeah, it wouldn't be right without the toucan, would it? Here is a quick look in the mirror. You can see the stripe down the leg, the stripe down the arm. This, this, this looks sick in my opinion. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I've been looking forward to this one. Um, I've been hyped for it. I've seen it all on social media and stuff like that. And I just like striped stuff right now, which leads me on to say the popularity of these joggers are absolutely ridiculous. I know there will be some of you out there that are wondering why I didn't pick up a new pair of joggers. Um, well, to be honest, the reason is um, they, they sold out. I, I wanted to. I wanted the red and white stripe down because I love these ones that I'm wearing right now. Um, and it's kind of the same material and all that kind of stuff. And plus... I have a hoodie that has a red and white stripe down it. Let me show you. So I bought this set, right? This set was from Boohoo. And as you can see, red and white stripe down the side. Here is the jumper and here is the joggers. The jumper fits me fine, but the joggers are absolutely huge for some reason. I mean, I can't complain because it was 20 pounds for both the jumper and the trousers. So like I say, I can't really complain too much. But the plan was to get the red and white Alpha Elite stripe joggers 
purely because then I could wear it as kind of a set and it would sort of, you know, it, it, it would match. Oh my God, it's a mess in here. So then basically what happened with the joggers is I got to my, I had them in my basket in a medium and then I got to check out at like six minutes past four, which is when it went live here in the UK. Um, and they just went, they just sold out. Um, so whether they didn't have that many units or what, I don't know. I was a bit gutted about it, to be honest. It is what it is, just testament to, to Alphalete, I guess. Like, job well done, Christian and the team um, on what I assume, again, will be a successful launch purely because um, I spent a lot of money. Um, lots of people watching this video will have spent a lot of money and, you know, overall very happy. So. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Uh, expect to be spammed with pictures all over my Instagram and all that kind of stuff. So, follow me, links in the description box as always. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. Let me know, did you pick anything up? Let me know in the comments section. Let's get a conversation going. Love you guys, thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one.